Welcome everyone to my release day unboxing of this guy Dimension 2 of Brighter Darkness. Um, today is actually, uh, this game actually came out the same day as my birthday. So um, today I actually am just now turning 20. Um, and it's pretty cool that this game is actually one of my favorite um, games to actually come out. And favorite type of JRPG style because way before I actually started recording videos for YouTube, I actually... Um, I played um, all throughout the Disgaea games from the original version, which this is actually the sequel to the original, the first Disgaea game with Lahara on the front. But um, I played through the first one, second, third, and fourth one. Um, I played through the third and fourth one last year, and way before I started videos and recording videos for YouTube and everything like that. Um, I really enjoyed the game, and I actually decided and heard about this game actually coming out today. And... Um, I've decided to pick it up as a big fan of this series, and um, I really didn't expect them to really come out with a new, a brand new Disgaea game since they already came out with Disgaea 4 last year. Because I thought that the like a new version of this game would actually end up being on the next gen consoles like the PlayStation 4 exclusively. But um, I was really surprised to actually find out that it's, it was actually coming out. They were coming out with a new, a brand new Disgaea game to play on the PS3, which is on the current gen, way before, uh, like a month before the uh, the next gen consoles are coming out, where you have the PS4 coming out and also the Xbox One, if you can believe it. And I'm really surprised and excited to play this game. But um, also, just to talk about a couple things, um, I'm. Also in this video, I'm just not only going to unbox this video and just um, talk about um, my history with this game and how I enjoy the, the type of gameplay style it is and everything like that. I'm going to also just talk about my little schedule, what I'm going to be doing this week in regards to my videos and everything like that. And um, what I'm going to be playing and what I'm going to be up to this week because um, I know it's a lot of games coming out soon and you got Ghosts coming out in what, um, I think four weeks from now. I'm really patiently awaiting for that and um, I can't really jump can't wait to start that game and really start um, playing the game, getting used to the controls and everything like that. And also, uh, not to mention that um, this Saturday is the release of uh, Pokemon X and Y. And um, if you can believe it, I did. Um, I do play Pokemon games, and my last Pokemon game I actually played was way back in. Um, I think it was the the last Pokemon game I actually ended up getting. Um, is um, I think it was um, back in the I think it was Pokemon, like Ruby and Sapphire, and um, I really stopped playing from there. I didn't really play too many other Pokemon games after that, because once I finished, like, because I actually had Pokemon Ruby version, but when I actually ended up finishing Pokemon Ruby, I just decided to stop playing Pokemon from there when when they started coming out with black and white. I didn't end up playing those games. I never played Pokemon. I never actually bothered buying Pokemon black and white. Because I know they came out with two different versions. You had the original black and white version. Then they came out eventually like. Uh, I think it was like a year later. The following year they came out with uh, black 2 and white 2 as well. But I never bothered playing those games. So um, also um, this will just probably not be the only release day unboxing video I'm doing this week. So I'll probably end up trying. Maybe I'll possibly end up getting um, either Pokemon X or Pokemon Y this coming Saturday. So I'll be doing a release day unboxing on that. But in regards to this game, I'm not going to be doing like videos of it. I want to do videos of this game as much as I would, but I'm actually in the middle of um, another JRPG, Tales of Exilia, and I still haven't beaten that game. And I haven't really been playing too much of it, but um, I've been playing a lot of it off screen, but I haven't been really posting videos of it. If you guys can see like in like the numerous playthroughs I'm in, in the middle of on my playlist, like I'm... I'm still just now, I just now, just not too long ago, started like Saints Row 4 and everything like that. Saints Row 4, um, GTA Online was the numerous problems I just started that was happening with the, trying to get the GTA Online to work. But um, I'm hearing it's um, actually fully functional now on the PSN and everything's up and running. Um, the problems are gone and the issues are resolved. So this week I'll be probably trying to put some more videos up of that and really officially jump in. Uh, into the GTA uh, GTA 5 online and just try out some game modes and mess around in uh, the city of Los Santos and have some fun and maybe some people that want to join me who would like to join me on um, GTA online can if you guys want to and um, also just put some other playthroughs I also didn't really finish up The Last of Us I'm still playing that game as well and I'm also playing Kingdom Hearts not the uh, HD remix but just the original I'm playing the, um, the older version from um, I'm actually playing it on my PlayStation 2 because I actually still own the um, 
the original Kingdom Hearts 1 game and the original Kingdom Hearts 2 for the PS2 as well. But just to name a couple of stuff, just uh, just so many games I'm actually playing and in the middle of. It's just a lot going on like in regards to a lot of games coming out. Um, but I wanted to show you guys and just unbox this game for you guys to show everybody that I got the game as a nice little um, birthday gift to myself as a big fan of the, um, this guy's series. And I'll just be playing it for my own enjoyment and everything like that. And th this week I'll just be trying to jump in a GTA Online and then um, starting tomorrow and really try to see, check out the online and, and experience it for myself. And possibly Saturday I'll probably try to, if I decide to get... The new Pokemon, which I probably will most likely end up getting one of the versions, just to, uh, that game I'll actually start doing the videos of it, um, begin my playthrough of um, either Pokemon X or Y, whatever one I end up getting. So without further ado, um, just I just wanted to give you guys a little, uh, just like a heads up of what I'm going to be doing and just a little schedule update in this video as well, If you, whenever you guys choose to watch this. So uh, without further ado, we'll jump it right in and try to um, unbox this game right quick so <clears throat> I know the game is really um, I'm really interested in this game since I played like the other recent installments of the game from this guy of four and all the way back to the original version from uh, the original this guy games as well way before I started doing videos for YouTube but um, I always been a fan of this game and I really didn't find out about any of these characters like uh, I don't know if you guys actually heard of the game Cross Edge. I actually played that game for the PlayStation 3. And um, that's when I first found out and discovered like Prinny and uh, Etna. And I found out that when I looked up those characters, I didn't know exactly who the characters were and exactly what they were, what game they were from. I thought they were just from like just made up characters right off the bat and just um, imported into the game. But I heard about the, uh, they were actually from this, this guy again. That's how I first found out about the whole Disgaea series from the game Cross Edge, which is an old PlayStation 3 game from, I think, 2009. So, um, it also just, um, just to also mention, it also mentioned that you also get, like, from the front, it says that you get, like, free DLC, you get free DLC from the, uh, for the game itself, for this guy, all the way until, like, um, November 8th, it inspires to, uh, for all the DLC that you can actually get so just to show you guys what else I got it came with this little cool art looking thing pretty cool with all the characters and stuff that are probably in the game that you can choose from and everything like that that's pretty cool so I'm trying to make sure there's no codes or anything like that that you can actually get from the game as well doesn't really look like it got your instruction booklet but I'm about to show that off in a minute so it comes with uh, official soundtrack with bonus tracks of uh, this guy dimension 2 just open this up a little bit you got your soundtrack disc in the left side and then you got a picture of Etna on the left and you got flying angel flying pretty much on the right side anything on the back it just has the list of the bonus tracks right here and you have the official soundtrack of everything of the game is on the left side and I thought it was something else inside let me try to see if it is and here's the bonus side track well the official soundtrack for the game so I'll probably be listening I don't listen too much of it it has a cool uh, soundtrack of the this guy games I like the soundtrack and everything and also with the little the humor of the uh, the plot and everything, and some of the funny things that the characters say as well. But uh, that's pretty much it for like the bonus art, the little soundtrack, and everything like that. And then you get your game disc, and you have your instruction booklet. But I'll check the booklet out after I check out the back side. So it says, "Demons and angels going stone cold crazy." Um, let's see, you battle in classic. Classic SR, SRPG style and force your ambitions to come true. Blast away enemies with mind-blowing over-the-top animations and work with allies. Increase your likability to perform splendidly powerful attacks. So obviously it's a single-player game as you guys can probably see in the corner down here. So that's pretty much it for the unboxing but I just want to show you guys a little bit of the 
instruction booklet and what it's like. So let's see. Some black and white, it's not of any color of some sort. So you have, it just shows you how to play like the lift and throws from the uh, original games. I know a lot about that because I played those other games from um, back in the day, way before I started doing videos. You got, talks about the item world, the darkest slim, assembly where you can just kind of increase your, um, put votes in like some topics or anything like that just to increase your characters and stuff. Um, let's see, what else do we have? What's well, in Spanish in the back? You got Demon Connect. I don't know what else that's about, but I'll just probably find out find out more about that as I play through the game. Um, warranty service and here's the Demon Connect thing, but I guess you can gain power by developing the the love and friendship between characters. We uh oh, it's in more is explained in the game, so I guess that's a, a new feature, the Demon Connect. But I don't know too much about that. So I'll just probably find that out of the game. But uh, that's pretty much it for the unboxing video. But I love the instruction booklet. It looks pretty cool. But that's pretty much it for this unboxing video. I'm not going to be doing videos of the game. So what I'll do is just that. I'll just probably end up doing like an impressions video. Since I'm not. I'm just going to be pretty much waiting for like ghosts to come out like since that's four weeks away I'll probably do an impression video impressions video of this game as I play through it and then for this week I'll just play through like I just will jump on GTA online and then possibly Saturday I'll probably end up getting uh, one of the new Pokemon games to and start a playthrough of that so since it's not going to be a playthrough of this guy Dimension 2 I'll definitely just be trying to do a playthrough of uh, the new Pokemon game and try to get that started Depending on which version I get, if I decide to get the game. So, in regards to videos with this, it will just be an impressions video. Just to talk about the game, what I feel about it, and what I think. And just comparing it to other games, like the original Disgaea games, since I played through those as well. So, um, that's it. Um, that's it for this video. So, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I don't know if you guys are a big fan of this series, or if you guys ever played this game before. Um... I definitely am, so that's why I decided to pick it up as a little, nice little birthday gift to myself, so uh, that's pretty much it, so I'll see you guys later for more gameplay, and um, I'll be back with GTA Online starting tomorrow.